Bonjour à tous et à toutes, je suis Tenko et je suis ici pour vous présenter un nouvel épisode du Walkthrough de Retour vers le futur. Dans cet épisode, nous allons démarrer le tout dernier épisode, euh, épisode en matière de jeux vidéo, je parle bien entendu, de Retour vers le futur qui s'appelle Out of Time. Donc, sans plus tarder, nous allons commencer et je vous laisse profiter de la cinématique d'introduction. Wake me up. I tried to give you a nudge before I left, but you were practically comatose. How long has it been since you slept? Aside from being knocked unconscious, I'm not really sure. Anyway, I left you back at the lab to perform an important mission. On the table next to my law books, there's a device plugged into the wall. I, uh, I think I see it. Is it glowing? Yeah. Is that good? Good? It's fantastic! Glowing means my static accumulator is charged up and ready for action. Bring it down to the high school and we'll... Damn! What? It's Edna! But... Okay, Emmett. One static accumulator coming up. Jeez, Doc. Watch out, you almost ran me over. Sorry about that, Martin. This vehicle is sometimes difficult to control. Uh, yeah. Hey, are you okay? After that argument about Emmett last night... I'm fine. Thank you for asking. With you. Where have you been all night? I've been driving around, looking up old friends, thinking things over. Okay. So is that what I'm destined to build for the Expo? Yeah, it's a static accumulator. Emmett spent all night building it. Turned out he didn't really need to see Frankenstein after all. He just needed a little push. And, and some lightning. Fascinating. I also had an epiphany last night. Doc? I realized that it wasn't Edna that made my life miserable. Doc! It was science! Mais la science, c'est tout pour vous. You can't give up science. You love science. Correct. My younger self loves science. But if Emmett doesn't go through with a demonstration at the expo, his dreams of being a scientist will dim just enough for Edna to step back into his life and steer him down another path. Une autre voie. Another path. What other path? I don't know. Architecture, automobile repair, taxidermy. Maybe I'll even pursue a life in law like my father always wanted. As long as Emmett steers clear of science, Edna and I will be free to be happy together. Emmett ne peut pas se remettre avec Edna. You can't want Emmett back with Edna. She used you to turn Hill Valley into a police state. She used my science to turn Hill Valley into a police state. But if I don't become a scientist, she'll never get the chance to vent her crazier ambitions. 
Doc, I'm begging you. You haven't thought this through. Haven't I? I guess we'll both find out. One thing's for sure. Emmett Brown's life will be a whole lot less complicated without a time machine in it. No! Ah! What the hell? Where'd it go? Et c'est là que le jeu commence, donc là il faut que j'essaie d'attraper ben, cet accumulateur statique. Accumulateur, pardon. Oh, come on! Here, little static thingy. <rire> là, il faut grimper au lampadaire. l'attraper au moment où il arrive à portée de main. Gotcha. Voilà. Ça, c'est fait. Shiny new tomorrow on the way. A day of invention is at hand. It's a mystic futuristic wonderland. Just around the bend, my friend, you'll see a dream or two. If you care to dream and dare to dream, your dreams can all come true. There's a world of wondrous wonder on display. Because the future is coming today. Not bad, eh? bad at all, but I thought you fired her. I found a loophole. What kind of loophole? Just a loophole. You're not the only one who's allowed to have secrets, you know. All right, all right. Say, don't you have to get that whatchamacallit to Emmett Brown's booth? Huh? Oh, uh, yeah, right. Because the future is coming. It's almost here now. The future is coming. It's getting clear now. Voilà, voilà. Trixie chante super bien. Ça, il n'y a pas photo. Donc, pour commencer, euh, nous allons aller parler. And here he comes, voilà. right on cue. No doubt he'll try to talk you out of it, detective. But you mustn't let your resolution waver. Hello, Crockett. Qu'est-ce que vous faites? What's going on here? Well, uh, Miss Strickland here seems to think. Uh... You should step aside and let the officer do his duty, now. Wait a minute, that's Emmett's levitator up there. Oh, don't be so modest. I'd say you deserve at least half the credit. It was you who tricked poor Emmett into breaking up with me. It was you who manipulated him into dropping my project in favor of this clear hazard to public safety. Et alors? So what? What's your point? Oh, I think you know exactly what my point is. Emmett's invention isn't going to work, is it? At least not the way poor Emmett thinks it is. How do you know this? I had a very interesting chat with Carl Sagan last night. I found out who Sonny Crockett really is, and where he comes from. Is there something you want to tell me, Sonny? Why don't you call him by his real name? Yakov Shmirnov. Thanks a lot, Doc. An anarchist! A foreign agitator bent on sowing chaos and destruction in the Hill Valley Expo! Annie, you don't believe any of this bullshit, do you? Sorry, uh, Yakov, but I really don't have a choice. Very good. And now, arrest this subversive! Come here. Look, here's the thing. 
I happen to believe this dame's got a screw loose. But she's been getting some clout in town, ever since that business with Kid Tannen. But Emmett's gotta fly that electrokinetic levitator at this demo. His whole future depends on it. And my future depends on making sure he doesn't. The chief reads her column religiously. And, well, if I don't do what she says, she's gonna start a campaign to have certain tainted officers removed from the force. Isn't there anything I can do? Not unless you've got some dirt on Edna. Something that'll discredit her in the eyes of the law. Well? I'll dig something up. You do that. In the meantime, you and young Mr. Brown better... Uh, where is he, anyway? Wait, you haven't seen him? Emmett? Has this foreign radical done something to my Emmett? Maybe you should find him. Oh, you're letting him go? This radical subversive? Just like that? Okay, so, I gotta find Emmett. And do something about Edna. Voilà, on commence le jeu avec deux objectifs. Donc, le premier objectif, retrouver Emmett, qui, pour le moment, on ne sait pas du tout où il est. Et, et trouver quelque chose pour discréditer euh, Edna aux yeux de la loi. Voilà, bon, c'est... Deux choses assez difficiles parce que pour le moment on n'a pas vraiment d'indice. Donc on va faire un petit peu le tour. Euh, Arthur McFly. Hey Artie, what do you think? Quite a setup, huh? The expo? Sure, but I was wondering. Oui, Emmett. Have you seen Emmett? He isn't at his booth. Odd. Well, he hasn't left the hall. I would have seen him. I'm sure he's around here somewhere. On peut retarder la démonstration d'Emmet. Is there any way you can delay Emmet's demo? He ran into some last minute turbulence. Emmet's already pushed his luck by substituting this electrokinetic whatsis for the mental alignment meter he was supposed to be showing. I can't alter his place on the roster too. The board would get the idea I was showing favoritism. Vous pouvez faire ouvrir le stand d'Emmet. Edna Strickland got Officer Parker to close Emmet's booth down. What? Why? She claims his invention is dangerous. Is it? That's not the point. Vous devez pouvoir faire ouvrir le stand d'Emmet. Is there anything you could do to get Emmet's booth reopened? I am afraid not. This may be a wondrous land of tomorrow, but it's still within the jurisdiction of the Hill Valley Police Force. Maybe you should talk to Officer Parker. He says there's nothing he can do as long as Edna's got clout in Hill Valley. She does have that. Comment Trixie a récupéré son boulot? Come on, you can tell me. How did you manage to get Trixie her job back? I thought her being Canadian was a deal breaker. If something's really important to you, you find a way. You ought to know that. Bon. See you around. Pour le moment, on n'aura pas plus d'indices que ça. On n'en a pas vraiment eu, mais bon. Ah oui, lui. <rire> How about an algae cake? Sure thing, Mister. Wait a minute. You're the guy that makes the algae cakes? But I thought you couldn't stand them. Hey, you're the guy that tried to pick up on my Eunice. Oh, for the love of no algae cakes for you, Buster. <rire> Je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo et à bientôt pour la suite du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.